so you can make this custom room complete and what do you mean by complete complete means simply install a custom room which is quite smooth you already know cr droid is one of the most smoothest custom room out there it doesn't brings you google apps pre-installed so you can use your own g apps whatever kind of google apps you want to install on a device and also all the useful features what you need actually need in a device should be present and this could be a complete perfect custom room choice for you we have installed cr droid latest version it brings you a lot of very useful customizations features already there in this one i will show you some of the useful features which you can try out and also two of the modules which you have to try out to make it perfect absolutely perfect so let's find out all of those features and amazing customizations included in cr droid make sure to watch this video till the end first one is moving on to cr droid settings in the clock and date settings you can enable this background chip option. Of course, it's not a major thing to deal with, but still it's not a bad deal at all. It looks very, very amazing in a custom room, in a device, when you have this kind of pill available background of the chip available in the status bar. Second one is the quick settings panel background. This is very, very amazing, especially in the terms of theming. This looks so good. As you can see by swiping down the quick settings panel, you can see this background opacity. In other words, you can say, and if you choose it up to 100 by default, which is by default 100, then you have the clean background. For example, in CR Drive, we have the light background. If you choose zero, then you have clear background. But in my case, I will choose 90% because this will give me the blur behind the quick settings panel, which looks so good. You can adjust it accordingly, which device you're using, whichever percentage you are comfortable with, you can choose that one. Another thing is also related to quick settings panel and what this is about, this is regarding Android 11 style quick settings panel. By default, you have this kind of really boring Android 14 style quick settings panel, but you can make it look like Android 11 style very easily. Choose the circle tiles and then you can adjust the rows and columns by default. In this case, I've chosen this four into five approximately, basically four tiles here. I have the option to choose the more columns in this case. For example, I can choose five columns right now. As you can see, this is how it is looking like. So you can make it look like perfect according to which device you're using, how you are comfortable with. So things are looking so good in this case too. So you have the option to adjust these kind of things too. Another thing which you can enable here is the data usage which is available in most of the OEMs by default, like MIUI, Hyper-OS, One UI, etc. And you have this option available in CR Droid 2 and in the quick settings panel, you will notice this data usage option present here. Could be useful for you. I'm not exactly sure how many of you use this, but in case you use this thing, it's available to enable. You can enable this thing directly from the quick settings panel option available in the CR Droid settings. Just including this one, if you move on to the user interface option, you will find some icon pack customizations and a lot more things. There are a lot of icon pack options present, but what I will choose that is Pavlova UI. Why so? Because if I enable this option, this is applied almost everywhere in the quick settings panel and the status bar, the progress bar also themes and almost everywhere you have theming options present there. Another thing is also related to theming, but this time it's related to fonts. In my case, I usually use Cocon fonts. These are so good because I tried a lot of fonts. These look amazing and as far as I know, it's available in many custom rooms too. But yes, we are talking about CR Droid. It's available in this case, so definitely you can choose this one. It depends which device you're using. Maybe if you have the unofficial version that is still not bad, you can make it look like perfect too. In the miscellaneous options, you will find the spoofing options also. For example, the higher FPS in games, which was okay. The play integrity spoofing option is also present. And you also have the option for three finger swipe gesture. So basically in this case, usually I use three finger screenshot. You can choose any other option too, in case you want to. So yes, things are looking so good in this case so far, but now it's time to choose some two extra things which are not available by default. What I have installed on my device is a small keyboard bar module in the Magisk, as you can see, and what this does is actually so useful for me. As if you are able to notice here, there's no space below keyboard. I always mention that. And now again, this is one of my favorite modules, one of my favorite mods. I don't, I just don't like the space 
below the keyboard and that option is present and that option is available for you to disable that directly by installing a module. Another one which is last but not the least, you can also use this disable flag secure. Unfortunately, this is not present in CR Red, quite strange. But yes, this is needed. So you can install this as a module. This is it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.